In Afghanistan, a suicide bomber has killed at least 30 people at a Shia mosque in Kabul. ISIL in Afghanistan is claiming responsibility. And this is the third major attack on Shias since July. CCTV's Catherine James has the story from Kabul. ISIL has claimed responsibility for a suicide attack against the Shiite population in Kabul. They had gathered in a mosque in the west of Afghanistan's capital for a religious uh, ceremony and a suicide bomber was sent in to target the, those gathered there. More than 30 were killed and scores more were wounded, including children. ISIL affiliates in eastern Afghanistan are largely Sunni and it is feared that they will seek to stoke the sectarian violence that they have made a hallmark of their work in Iraq and Syria, targeting any groups that are not Sunni. Sectarian violence is not common in Afghanistan, and these last four months, ISIL has carried out three major attacks against the Shiite population, including an attack in July that was the single deadliest attack against a civilian population in Afghanistan in 15 years. President Ashraf Ghani, the United Nations and the United States National Security Council all condemned the attack and point to it as an effort on the part of these ISIL groups to stoke sectarian violence. However, the president was very clear, as were other leaders in Afghanistan, that Afghans will not fall prey to these efforts to sow the discord. However, of course, among the civilian population, particularly those among the Shiite uh, groups, there are questions as to whether the government can actually protect them against future attacks like this. There are calls for the leadership to do more to protect the civilians in these areas. Catherine James, CCTV, Kabul.